Hi guys, it's me, Miss Carolina. Welcome back to my channel. Um, thank you if you watched my last video and thank you for joining me today. So today I want to be showing you how I achieved this colour. I purchased this frontal and these bundles from Ali Grace here. I purchased it with my own coins. This video is not sponsored. So if you would like to see how I achieved this colour, how I got to this kind of look, please keep watching thank you see you soon okay guys so i already constructed this unit using my sewing machine so i previously lifted the frontal and the bundles before however i decided i wanted to go to a nice sienna brown so i decided that i'm gonna actually bleach all of this on camera and record this video for you guys what I always do before I start to bleach each section, I comb it through, as you can see here, and then I apply the bleach to the ends and work my way up. So as you can see, I've, ne I've done nearly all of the back, and I'm just using my fingers to rub and massage that bleach in. I was using the foil, however, I'm not really that great with using the foil. I tend to get a little bit messy when I'm bleaching hair. So yeah, I've moved on here to the left side of the frontal and I just take my time going through it slowly, making sure that I use my fingers to massage over it. So I left the bleach off for about one hour and then it got me to this nice like brown tone. What I did realise was that the bleach took really, really well. The frontal took really, really well to the bleach and same with the bundles however I did end up with quite some different tones which I didn't mind and then I just started to use this adore sienna brown to dye the hair as you can see here I'm applying it once again starting from the ends and I'm just working my way up slowly with the dyeing brush what I do also do is get a small fine tooth comb and sometimes dip that in the dye and tend to just comb it over just to make sure that the hair is fully covered with the dye let me know guys if you would like to see a video of how I sew my units using my sewing machine let me know if you would like to see that as a video So now I'm just at the front, I'm working on the front frontal. As you can see the bleach took, the frontal took really really well to the bleach, to the bleach, it lifted really really well. Um, I worked my way once again starting from the bottom up, however I do take really a long time to do this. I also use my comb once again to go over everything smooth just to ensure that frontal the hair is all fully covered in the dye I also use two different sizes of brushes I tend to use a big one for the ends and a really small one just because I don't want the um, dye to seep through onto the lace frontal so as you can see here I continue to work my way up to the top of the frontal and then once I have fully completed one side, I then move on to the other side. However, I did lose that footage, so I'm really sorry about that. I do like to use a fine tooth comb. Just when I'm closer to the front, I like to dip it into the dye and comb through the hair. Just to... Okay, so as you can see here, the hair is fully covered in the dye. I leave the dye to sit for about another two hours. So I'm now moving on to the plucking. And what I always do is when I am plucking my frontals, I always make sure that they are wet. And what I always do is just do a small parting. And behind that front line is where I start to pluck. I pluck the hair randomly just because I want to make sure that the transition between the hairline and my skin is just a smooth transition. A 
Let me know in the comments if you would like to see a more detailed version of how I pluck my frontals. I would be. Let me know. Also, let me know if you'd like to see a video on how I sew my frontal units using my sewing machine. Let me know right in the comments, guys. So rather than using my curling one, this time I decided to put my hand to bendy rollers. As you can see, I also sewed an, an elastic band into the unit. So I cut the lace off camera and now I'm just fitting it onto my head with the got to be glue. And what I do is I just put the got to be glue on one side and then I get my blow dry and I use the blow dry on a cool setting and I wait until it becomes tacky and then I apply pressure to the frontal at times I also tend to use the got to be glue spray just to make sure that it's extra secure once the frontal is applied and then I just go over that with the end of the tail comb just to apply pressure into the unit. Just cutting around the excess around my ear, just cutting that around. Remember ladies that the frontal is made to be cut the 13 by 4 or 13 by 6 frontals are always made to be cut around the ear okay so that extra piece of lace is always made to be cut around the, the ear to ensure you have a secure fit as you can see I'm just repeating the same method on the other side using the got to be glue and the hair dryer So I'm just using the comb to go over and I brush out the curls and this is the style that I'm left with. Um, what I'm now doing is using my organic foam wrap move just to go around and to smooth out the top of the unit. I'm just going to comb that through as you can see here. And I'm just using my curling iron just to smooth down any flyaways let me know if you like this color on me um, I don't normally rock this color let me know guys if you guys prefer using your curling wand or bendy rollers or what kind of curling method you prefer so this is the final look guys I done my makeup off camera this is the final look I'm actually really really liking this look let me know if you like it So before I got this unit from Ali Grace, well actually it's not unit, it's bundles and a frontal. Um, I cannot remember but I will write the information in the box. Let me know if you like this look, if you like the colour. The hair took really well to the bleach, especially the frontal. Normally I wouldn't rock a colour like this from the roots but I thought I'd give it a try. Let me know if you like it, if, if you want to see me try any other colours. Let me know guys, thanks for watching. Bye. Don't forget to comment, like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you. Bye.